It's almost ready. The giant building. Almost ready. So this is going to be... If I did this correctly... Actually, check the power. And yeah, this one's getting pretty up there. Is this the one that has... Uh, no. So why are you getting so... Oh, it's because of this. Wait, why didn't I install that? Power switch should be right here. Oh, it won't fit. You have to put it here then. We need to dismantle the utility through here. I need to put it here instead. Like that. So dismantle all this. But it's because this is on the main grid. That's a problem. This could blow. We have sprinkler systems here, and it's close enough to where any lockdown you guys do, the fire department will be able to get through this first one anyway. First death row prisoner has just arrived. Oh, we'll need to make sure to have a death row appeal program set up in the parole room so that they can have their appeal hearings. That's what I got this little, uh, this little thing here for. Yep. That's what I got it for. Let's get the, uh, let's get that program in place, though. Uh, death row appeals. There you go. Death row appeals. And that needs to happen not in that room. No. Not in that room. Death row appeals happens in the proper room. If I could, please, have that happen. Let's take a look at our death row inmate. Is it you? No, it's you. Joseph Ion. Sentenced to 69 years for multiple crimes, including murder, armed robbery, and attempted murder. He has a 40% chance of clemency right now. 40% is pretty good. He has no known reputation, so he'll probably be a model inmate for a while. He's 20 years old. That's unfortunate. Sorry, dude. Should have thought about that before you broke the law and murdered people. Maybe I'm not sorry. Alright, so. How am I laying this out? <clears throat> I am laying this. Let's put. Let's. Let's get the walls put in first so I can just see what I'm doing here. Light wise, I'm actually glad there's no lights so that I can have the lights in the individual rooms once they're done. So. This camera, are you getting anybody? Fearless, stoical, can't see any gang members in that group actually. There are 10 reds, but no leaders yet. 10 reds though. Starting to get up there where they might recruit them, might recruit from within, you know? Yeah, utilities are hooked up now. So let's switch this off. Not saying that the room doesn't have electricity. I would like the room itself to have some power. So I'm gonna have a little, I'm gonna have this thing kind of go around it just to like have the lights on. Something like that. Just to have the lights on. Let this be open. Mr. Ion, 40% chance. When is your first parole meeting, parole hearing? When does your first one happen? At 10 a.m. Happens at 10 a.m. Can I change that? Can we have that happen sooner? I'd, I'd really love to know whether or not you're actually going to be staying with us for a while. Let's try... Death Row Appeal. Let's have it at 2. Which is now, actually. Which is now. Two PM, are you No, he's gonna wait till tomorrow then. Okay, well, in that case I could put it back to the to the morning. 
10 a.m. it is. Enjoy that. Enjoy that. Does this not have any, li have any lights? It doesn't have any lights. I put lights in my rooms. This hallway doesn't have any lights. It's just this dark abyss. Okay, these lights are in here now. So what I want to do... First, I want to make sure this is all concrete. Second thing I want to do... Is make sure we have some sort of path through here. Let's close this fence. And open this one. This sniper became a lot less effective just now. It'll still get people digging this way, but it became a lot less effective. I'm gonna put the perimeter wall through here. And a little bit this way, just because. Let's get... Planning. Did I measure you right? 61. No, I didn't, but maybe I can make it work. 61 by 51. I uh, Can I work? Can it make it work? Can I make it work? I don't know. 16. 16. 21. 21. not dead eye middle because of the numbers but I think it will work okay I think it might be fine let me now take and bulldoze this so that's gonna be outdoors now yep that's a yard we have this big yard and we have a little yard over here uh, then I want to have Actually, if I don't need the yard, this is a big yard. If we concentrate, you know, this removes the sn Apparently you can't cancel a bulldozing job. It doesn't let you actually cancel the bulldozing job. That's weird. I can't cancel that. Huh. Okay. Well, for now, that's gonna be bulldozed. I might have to, I might fill it in again, but for now, it's bulldozed. People working in the laundry. Yep. Working in the laundry, yeah. I wish we had uh, more people working in the workshop. I need more people to know carpentry. Two people haven't passed the carpentry course yet. What's your chance at passing? At least it's not zero. I thought it would be zero. At least it's not zero. Carpentry. Who else is gonna pass, hopefully? You. Moving very fast, you. Your chance is a little better. Gotta cross my fingers for you two. But how long until you're out of here, though? You're up for parole pretty quick. And you will pass. So. That's the problem. Like, you, you spend all this money to train your prisoners. And the ones that are really good and they're going to do their job and they're not going to cause trouble. They end up getting out for parole. And so, you end up having to... Yeah, they're going to get out for parole. So, 15 max. Well, that's shitty. I didn't know I still had that on. All right, 15 max is coming in. So this is now my outdoor area. My outdoor area. And that will be a yard. But before that becomes a yard, you are going to be... You are. 
your cells in this area. Yep. Like so. I don't think I measured this right. And... That many, I think? Fifteen cells along the wall. Fifteen cells along that wall. Then we go out a little bit. Should be enough for... Yep, there we go, good. And then back up all the way to here. Hopefully that's even. This is the part where I think I messed it up. good okay uh, and then from there this is not the path anymore though it's not our walking path anymore we can move it I guess it's gonna have to be here instead how does that work for this part down here though I'm not gonna have enough room for the I'm gonna have to do something like this then. Because I need this to be there, I think. I'm gonna have to be a little bit like that. <laughs> Walkway there. <coughs> I think so. Then, more cells. Nah, it's too close, it's crowding. It's gonna have to open up like this. think about there and then another right there yep okay that works split this from this wing yeah fine whatever that's see that's the canteen that's the kitchen uh common room <sighs> that's gonna it's pretty obvious that this one is the canteen but i'll do this this is our canteen. All right. Now, down here, we have common room, kitchen, canteen, laundry there. Uh, over here, I want to have... What was it? I have to look at the list just to know. There has to be another staff room. And there's going to be another staff room with food. Because I don't want them to have to come all the way over here. This is like... Right now, this is the only canteen. Or this is the only staff room with food. So we need another staff facility that has staff bathrooms and things like that. And that's what's going to go over here now. So that will be, I think, here. It'll be a big staff room. We can put that right up against the yard, I think. That will give us a little bit of influence in that area, I think. So we'll, we'll try that. <laughs> and then uh, probably we'll go bathrooms all the way on this side. So... Give them, like, individual stalls. And I didn't do that one right, did I? That's okay. This is going to be where the sink is. Uh, and then we'll do... Yeah, door, 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 door. That will be staff bathrooms. And then we follow that up with... Like, just like a little... Like a doorway into the bathroom area. And then this will be the big another big staff room where we can have people eating and food and tables and things. So we'll have that there. And now, how to get into the canteen? They'll have to go through the yard to get into the canteen. This saves me from having to do metal detectors between the kitchen. Or this saves me from having to do metal, te metal detectors between the yard and the canteen, and then the yard and the exit, or the, uh, the canteen and the exit. If I make it to where they have to go through the yard, then I only need metal detectors in that one area. So I'm going to go... With two metal detectors here and here. Let's just grab uh, objects. We'll go like that with it. No, we'll scoot it in one. We'll scoot it in like this. That way we can have the trays. One, two, three, four. 
one, two, three, four. Uh, one, two, three, four. Door for the kitchen there. Three trays, two bins. I like it. Let's get to work on that. So we'll go... Serving tables, yep. Oh, they're, they're five big. Okay. I thought they were four. Well, we can just have two tables then. It's, I'm sure two tables will be fine. If it's not, we could always go like this instead. Maybe we'll do that instead. So we can move this over all the way to the, the wall area. And then we can have two, we can have four, four tables back to back like this. That looks okay. As long as our tables end up being rightly spaced. So we'll do four this way. Yeah, basically four by three. Kind of like that. Nice. They fit. Excellent. It doesn't line up with this. Uh, maybe it could. If we really have to have it, it will, it will please the symmetry gods. To have it line up with this, I guess. And then I could always move this down as well. Just because. Put bins here, maybe. Okay, we'll have it line up. It'll be fine. So let's get on that. I'll start building that now. I have 131,000 bucks. I'm gonna start building that. Table, 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 table. Table, table, all the way like that. Serving tables will go there, 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 and there. Kitchens and cookers and stuffs. I haven't even, I haven't thought about my kitchen plans yet, but I think I'm gonna line the cookers up back to back like this. And then we'll put the fridges along this wall. We get the kitchen sinks. Hmm. No. We'll line the kitchen sinks up like this. Yeah, like that. Then the fridge. Fridge can go next to the, the cookers. It's a little crowded, but it could work. Mm hmm. Staff door there. Staff door there. Nope. Staff door there. Uh huh. Then we have bins. There and there. Also have bins here, here. Actually, those two bins will be, will be fine. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Yeah, let's let's do that. Let's grab the the walls. Start getting this place built. Common room. We'll wait on that for a bit. Let's get this done. Like that. Good. All this is getting built. We want the staff room to get built too. Let's make there be a door. How about here? Reminder from earlier, there's a big-ass door you can use. Yeah, I know. We'll get that. I'm gonna use the big-ass door, don't worry. Definitely gonna use the big-ass door at some point. So, uh, it's a personal mission of mine to use that door for something. But it doesn't really have any use right this minute. Any, no particular use right now. Let's get the staff door there. Probably want another one on this side. So we put one maybe... Maybe there and there. Just kind of like a way for them to get in and out. Uh, okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, this is our yard area. We are going to have this be closed off. We'll have a yard there. We've got the laundry area, which will get built. Uh, we want also to have... Uh, yeah, we need to have the, uh, a new power solution as well. Definitely needs a new power solution. That's gonna have to go out here, and that's gonna be very hard for fire department to get to it. 
So, I mean, don't really have a whole lot of options for that because I kind of want it to be close to this whole thing. I guess I could put it down in here. I guess I could make it easier for the fire department to reach it, but just have a lot more cabling. I don't know if I really need all of this space. So I could put it here and I will. So let's take this and we'll get this out and all the way up through here. Nope, one too many. All the way up through here, there we go. Like that. Gonna wanna go through uh, there. Let's go up and get connected to the stoves and such. Yep. Uh, we're gonna need water pipes, boilers, all that good stuff too. Probably a new water pump, because it's gonna be a lot of, it's gonna be a long distance. Because we are gonna expand up, so this could help serve that. So we can get another water pump if we want to. I'm thinking here, and then fenced off. No, one more in thinking like this yeah and then fenced off like this with a staff door here just because like that okay so there's a lot of stuff for them to build but this is like a new wing that we're starting we can expand it down here a bit but the idea is, I don't want all of the prisoners ending up in this one canteen. I do want them to kind of split themselves. They're going to split themselves this way. They're going to split themselves this way. And they're going to split themselves over into this one. Also, as we expand this way, we'll need a canteen facilities for these guys. Which is why there's a perimeter wall here. But this is a regular fence. Because I'm eventually going to just kind of keep this wing going. Um, so I don't need the perimeter wall. I think I got the perimeter wall going okay. I might expand it that way. Like from this wall. And not from this wall, but we'll see. I kind of got this a little bit. I probably will tear this down. We'll see. I think it needs to go like this. Through the kitchen and through the canteen. But then it also needs to come this way. Now let's put it right through the middle of the yard like this. I think from there it can cover everything. I can cover everything from there, I think. So all of the plumbing stuff is going to be on this side of the cells. So we can do something like this with that. All the plumbing stuff will again will be on this side of the cells. So we can go and do plumbing like that. Let's connect it over here just because. Hopefully that plumbing works. Hopefully. The sprinklers are on the big pipe. That's a good thing. We have a death today. Somebody didn't make their parole hearing. That sucks. For the for that guy. Did we get... Ooh, he's got visitation, but he didn't make his parole. I don't think he made his parole. Wait, he's got visitation at the same time. He's supposed to be in here. It's 10 o'clock. He's supposed to be in here. What's he doing? Do you not want your parole hearing? You're supposed to be in here with your magistrates. There you go. Let's see what happens to him. Let's see what happens to him. Maybe he gets out, maybe he doesn't. You know? Uh, I just had intake. Yep, just had intake. That was at eight. So we can bring this back down to nothing except for one more death row inmate. I want to see if he gets clemency. Joseph Ion. See what happens. 40%. I mean, it's kind of 50-50. It's pretty close. Good chance of clemency. It goes down to 20% if he fails. I can't speed up time any more than I already am. I think he's I think it's done it too. 
I think it's a four hour thing. So he might, oh. Joseph Ion got, got himself some clemency. He now has 69 years, but he's in maximum security. There you go. Maximum security. He got out. 69 years. That's how many years he had before. He was sentenced to 69 years before for all of his stuff. But then, instead of being put to death, now he's got himself uh, to serve 69 years in the prison. So, Joseph Ion. Totally forgot where you are. I want to know where you went. Where's Ion? Where'd he go? Well, I want to know where Sully is, because I want to I see his rep and stuff. Ion. Oh, God. It's going to be hard as hell to find him in here. Where's the search function when you need it? There he is. There he is. So, no reputation. One day is in the prison. Success. Death row appeal. 89% chance to reoffend. Maybe we can reform this man. He can get out before he dies of old age. All those water pipes. We're gonna need hot water too. Because we're gonna want the showers and stuff to work. We won't want hot water for all these showers. These pipes are so expensive. Spending so much money on them. All right, now you have to figure out where they're gonna come in at, too. I think that just answered the question for me right there. So we'll have this pipe go there. Follow that up with a water boiler there. And then the, the power will, I guess, also go down to there. So these guys got a lot of work to do. We're gonna have to let them just get on it, you know? He can get out at 89, that's right. That's right, 89 years old. Is he up eligible for parole ever though? Or is that, like he has to serve that whole sentence? Where's Ion? Ion, there you are. Find the man again, no. Yeah, Ion. Yeah, he has to serve, so no, no eligibility for parole, early release. He has to serve the whole sentence, so. No early release for him. The fact that he's not being put down is probably a win for him. Mm -hmm.